Crawford. I seen you as a clown when you cut off your dreads to fit in with the Fox Sports. But I'm not going to even get into that, but I already know you, brother. You try to fit in some type of group so you could belong with your so-called Fox colleagues who don't accept. Off well, they, they got to win, but they, they need to. Well, I need to put some things in my jaw to do the beaver face that you got. Hey, show, show. RJ, y'all. RJ, y'all. Show Deion Sanders. Deion Sanders in Colorado, yet again, they prove my point, they're inexperienced, and they don't belong. I'm RJ, I'm the little dweeb who wanna fit in for me, That I'm one of the good Negroes. I'm not like them over there, I'm different. Look, I can talk bad about Colorado too, I shut up. I see the jealousy and hate. I see the jealousy and hate. I see the jealousy and hate. Bro, that's a pass interference. The defender wasn't turning. He wasn't even looking at the ball. Look it. You got. You got to turn around. If you're not watching this game, you're missing out. If you're not watching this game, you're missing out. You're missing out. Amazing. <laughs> content, content, content. Uh, make sure you subscribe to this channel subscribe to this channel because we're on a mission to get him a million subscribers before the season starts we need a million a million subscribers and if you subscribe and get somebody else to subscribe we will eclipse that quickly quickly I mean quickly but if you do that and you prove to us that you've done that we're gonna give you a call all okay? right mm. we'll give you a call we'll do that we'll make that happen and we'll go that too much you're not a credible source for college football your entire career on the college platforms you're a tap dancer nobody should ever take your word serious you'll say anything to get the views on your channel i can't respect you no more gang calling lames like you out and all these other pundits out you relentlessly over criticized Colorado while you got on your knees for teams like Oklahoma. Tennessee went through them boys like it was butter and hot fire. Get out of here with that. You are a yapper. 
I seen you as a clown when you cut off your dreads to fit in with the Fox Sports. But I'm not going to even get into that, but I already know you, brother. You try to fit in some type of group so you could belong with your so-called Fox colleagues who don't accept you as you are. So crocodile dudes like you have to go around pretending that you know something just to fit in. I could really break you down and how the ladies say it. I could read you. I don't got time to do all that today. I want to go deeper. Scrubs like you would never admit you was 100% wrong about Colorado. You're going to find a way to downplay the win and critique, over critique Colorado's defense. Off. Well, they, they got to win, but they, they need to, well, I need to put some things in my jaw to do the beaver face that you got. Hey, show, show. RJ, y'all, RJ, y'all, show Deion Sanders, Deion Sanders in Colorado, yet again, they prove my point, they're inexperienced, and they don't belong, I'm RJ, I'm the little dweeb who want to fit in, I had long dreads and I had to cut, I used to put my mom in my videos so you can feel good for me that I'm one of the good Negroes, I'm not like them over there, I'm different, look, I can talk bad about Colorado too, I shut up! Shut your weak ass up, man. That about Colorado too. Like, shut up. Shut your weak ass up, man. All your videos are lame, boring. You just now getting YouTube honored. You didn't get no views in the last three years, bruh. You better get on your knees like you get on your knees for your Fox handlers and say, thank God we got a Deion Sanders. In fact, all you haters need to get on your knees and thank God Deion Sanders came through. I'm not being humble no more. I'm tired of being the humble guy because we go about it the right way. These weirdos pop up out of nowhere. It's a new arch nemesis for I will take over Colorado one day. I shall meet Dion in the match of hell. <laughs> Shut up! Fake villain wanna be lame? Like, I already can read you niggas. You don't even be having your facts straight. You'll bring some weak argument and forgetting the whole point. This is only the second year and the second uh, season of Coach Prime being a Power 5 coach. And he done made works out of some of you dudes who done been here 30, 40, 20, 15 years. And where is... RJ, I'm RJ. Uh, I don't think, I don't think they're gonna win today. No, no, no. I, I hate niggas like you who got this condescending tone and weak, lame face. As if we don't know why you saying all this sucker is, bro. You got on your knees for some of these weak teams that got exposed by people like South Alabama last year. And the nerve you trying to talk down on Deion Sanders in them victory against North Dakota. Did you see the game that Oklahoma played? I put my money on North Dakota against Oklahoma. And then weak Ohio State. You overhyped them too. Ohio State is not a third-ranked team. You hear me? I mean, I put my money on Colorado when we play Ohio State. Well, I, 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 I'm going I'm to I'm slow down a little bit to keep it real because they got some good receivers, bro. They got some great receivers. Other than that, Ohio State ain't no goddamn number three team. I'm not saying to be a boss. You got to pay the price. saying Colorado is no number three team. That would be asinine in the words of, you know, Stephen A. Smith. You know, you know, it is over here. I, I like Stephen A. Smith. Some of his points he makes, I shut up, RJ. You ain't even Stephen A. Smith. You just a step and fetching, boy. 
You always gonna be a boy in the eyes of your colleagues. All them dudes surpass you. You've been doing this college stitch for years and nobody don't pay attention to no, Dion, he's not really getting it. I told you guys, you didn't tell us nothing about Colorado. I got the proof on you, boy. Last year you was on your knees for Colorado. You did all that sniffing and stretching. You wanted to get a taste of them boys. I think you even did an interview with Shador. I seen you, boy. What, did they cancel one of your future interviews? Just like Sean Keeler, you're doing the most. I can't stand dudes like you. I'm not telling you to stay on code. You don't gotta, I mean, st I am telling you to stay on code. It don't mean be biased for Deion Sanders. And them hell, I critique them too. But I'm a fair person, bro. You just decided, I'm gonna be their arch nemesis. What are we going to do today? This is you haters when I see you. You got the face of a chipmunk, RJ. What are we gonna do today? Brain, brain, what are we gonna do today? The same thing we do every day. Try to disparage Dion in Colorado. <laughs> Shut up. Weak type of dude, bro. I know you ain't even got a woman in this world that wants you, bro. Anybody take your girl from you, bro. You just look like a smackable face. Shut up. Tired of seeing your face. You like, what, five foot five? You know I'm not lying. Or just the height don't mean anything, but I'm just bringing... You like this magical leprechaun that don't know when to go back to that magical rainbow, bro. You ain't got gold to give the world. You're just yapping. You do your videos a week ahead of time, and then you start dropping them, and you oversaturate the market with garbage and... <laughs> them and you oversaturate the market with garbage analysis we can't take you serious you're just like Stephen a smith you can't even know you don't even know how it feels this it, to, to speak independent like this do you know how much of a liberated feeling it is to be your own man that's truly independent you sold out years ago when you went to fox you didn't even progress and elevate it to a bigger stature you just the little weirdo who just the yes man on everybody's platform out here bruh I don't got no respect for no RJ. Like, RJ to what? Like, what is that little turd, bruh? He look like something you wiped off by accident when you forgot the flush and you had to double back. No diddy, no diddy. That's what he looks like. Do you pay attention to something like that? No, you put it in the toilet and you flush that bit. You feel me? RJ, come with your weak analysis. What you got to say now, boy? Please don't talk about Colorado. Stay over there, bruh. All these overrated goddamn... A, a, a top 25 teams and don't tell me nothing about Kansas State, bro. Wait till they play a real team, bro. Cuz they're damn near about to lose to regular teams like Tulane, bro. You didn't over critique them. How come you don't have the same in RJ? The way you and weak dudes like Matt Barry, you had all this to say about Coach Prime, bro, when they lost to Matt Rule in Nebraska. But I'm looking at all you fake wanna be weirdos you didn't have this same energy when Colorado beat them worse last year. Dion is the first time coach and Colorado entire damn team as a unit to be in the power five and, and beating Matt Rule, who's supposed to be a future Hall of Fame coach, at least college Hall of Fame coach because he failed in the NFL. That's what everybody tells me. He's a future Hall of Fame college coach and he got destroyed by Dion last year. What was your leprechaun? Yeah, I, I'm RJ. I don't think Colorado is it. I mean, it's just all hype. It's all hype. It's all hype, you know? I seen your weak tell in the comment sections. But I
tell in the comment sections. Boy, don't let me flame you, boy. I seen your rebuttals to everybody. Passive aggressive weirdo. Bro, I want to use the other word on this video. I can't because you're conniving little weasel self. He's saying this about me. That DJ Bless one. I, I don't put the goddamn pencil down, boy. You're not in school, boy. What is you teaching? You're a step in fetching for Fox Sports, bro. That's it. You'll say anything to play it safe to get some type of deal. And I don't mind us doing what we got to do to get paid, but goddamn, you might as well go on Fifth Street, put your pants down and say you open for business, boy. Open and say, ah, a weird little, like a little munchkin, little weirdo running out of here, yapping the most, doing all that talking, little frail creature. Like, I'll put you back. Where you belong with the gophers. Don't let that go into your head, bruh. I wish I seen niggas like you in real life, bro. Like, oh, God, I wouldn't physically do nothing to you because I'm not a bully. I'm not. No, I just would like to look at this face. I, I don't see nothing in Colorado. I don't see nothing. Well, why you don't do the same thing to your, you know, the people you look up to, the people you wish you could be? I know you wish you could put that bleach on your face and wipe everything off. And then you're uncomfortable when you try to sound like a brother. I've, I've heard dudes code switching to sound white. But have you ever seen a brother like code so look, There's nothing wrong sounding articulate, educational, and all that. That's me right there. You feel me? People say I sound like the other nations or whatever. But you don't hear me forcing it. It's just my regular tone of voice. But I hate these dudes like RJ who, I got, yeah, like, like, nigga, that ain't how you speak, nigga. I see what type of mama you got. I can tell. When the last time you ate some soul food in your spirit, boy? Some good old American apple pie. And you're quite all right. Shut up, boy. Can't stand you dudes who's really using Dion to build your name. You've been on this YouTube thing for like seven years. Nobody knows you, RJ. I was subscribed to you. I thought, I feel sorry for this guy. He's trying. Look at his spirit. I done forgot about I subscribed to you. I didn't see you in two years and I was still subscribed to you. All of a sudden, you get to talking about Dion. It done resurrected your weak platform. At least be grateful, my guy. All this extra you doing, stay over there, bro. We don't need none of your... And it's not like you was going to give them real credit anyways. You're on your knees for these other nations who don't give a damn about you. They look... When they give you an interview, it takes you three, four months later to get an interview from them. They don't care about no goddamn RJ. You're somebody they put on the back of the bus. Get to the back of the bus, little nigga. God, I mean, I'm DJ Bless One, the best one. Love your family, love your kids, stay man. DJ Bless One, I'm gonna see about you, DJ Bless One. I'm gonna report you. What are you saying? Shut up! I see the jealousy and hate. I see the jealousy and hate. Fuck that shit, we gon' be straight. Hold up, hold up, bitch. I see the jealousy and hate. I got shit up on my plate. Oh, uh -huh.